<clears throat> hey guys this is gonna be for my earth signs just general and let's see try to see what decks i'm gonna use how i'm gonna do it sorry that was loud wasn't it okay hope you guys are doing good let me know in the comments If you would like a personal reading, my email will be in the description box below. Also, find me on Facebook business page, Lachey Moon. I do free reading giveaways and cash giveaways on there also. Um, I may start doing free reading giveaways on here. We'll just see how things go. I am going to do a cash giveaway when we get to 500 subscribers. Um, I might even do it at 400, you know, like I just like giving back, um, because you guys and spirit seems to always bless me. So I like to give back to the people that support me. I just love it. You know, you guys definitely make a huge difference in my life. Okay. So if you have spirit, please open up my channeling. Please give clear, accurate messages and protect me and my collective. So what do you have for earth signs? What do you have for earth signs, spirit? Automatically ace of wands. Okay, so someone's finding you really attractive. Somebody is um, finding you really sexually attractive right now. And um, also thinking about having new beginnings with you. Oh, this, oh, look, wow. I mean, you can't make it. I sp <laughs> that was bottom of the deck. Then I put them together, split the deck, and then there it is again. And then there's eight of cups. So you may have walked away um, from somebody or somebody might be contemplating walking away from a situation to have a new beginning with you. Okay. Oop. Five of swords wanted to pop out too because you, as you see the eights of cups just fell so there is some lying manipulating um or some thoughts here you see how he's sitting so there's like someone thinking maybe about their behavior maybe about their actions what they've done to somebody that was manipulative um look at the swords here i feel like it's words like they're really thinking about what they said to somebody um or like you know um the things that they did that cut them or stab them in the back, okay? I just heard stabbing in the back. So someone may have recently stabbed you in the back or it feels like they have. Okay. All right, Spirit, tell me what's going on for the earth signs. Thank you. Strength in reverse. Okay. King of Swords. So this might be you standing in your power, speaking your truth. This is someone who's really, you know, like they stand in their true authentic state self and tell the truth like regardless um okay so strength card came out first in reverse so someone's not feeling like they have the strength right now mm, they're putting work into something okay that might be the person that's wanting to bring an offer towards you or you might be wanting to bring an offer towards somebody but you don't feel like you have the strength to put in the work maybe a whole lot of work is going to have to be put in the situation um, and you or the person, the energy that I'm picking up on. Yeah, because there's going to have to be some kind of clarity and truth resolved around, around the matter here. The high priestess. So, um, this is also tapping into your intuitive abilities and connecting to source energy that you always have like an inner knowing of what the truth is. Okay, so and this is also learning to trust that instead of learn like instead of trusting what people have told you, especially with that five of swords energy where people were like manipulative or um, not telling you the truth. You're learning to follow your intuition no matter what people say, because your intuition is going to lead you towards the truth this is also going to guide you on your path where people, you know, may be trying to manipulate you off your path. Okay, spirit, what else for that? Sorry, guys. What else for the earth signs? Two of cups. So this is all about soul connection. This is all about um, 
like coming together with like either your soul family, soul tribe, or actually like an actual soul soul mate, like someone that you have deep feelings for. And this might be, maybe you're getting intuition on who this person is. Maybe you're using your intuition, like you're getting downloads and you're getting messages. Death, okay, this is where you're either being called to go through a transformation or you are going through a transformation. You're, you know, you're ending things that need to end in your life or you're just like transforming, like, because you're wanting to move into calmer waters because right here with the five of ones, there's like competition. All right, so these are people, places and things trying to hold you back. And Page of Swords, you, you're probably studying the people around you is what I'm getting right here. This could be somebody studying you, but I really feel like this is you studying other people. Um, and you're, you're not you're not just listening to people anymore. And I love that. Like you're seeking more um, guidance from the universe on what the truth is. Okay. You may be starting to realize that certain people have not always been honest with you, have not always give you the best advice. So now, you, you know... I feel like you're listening to these people, but you're not, that's not, you know what I mean? You're starting to have more confidence in yourself. Um, you're starting to realize that you are actually stable. Like maybe you've doubted that in the past and you're starting to realize that you are the stable one. Like all these people that you were asking advice for, they're not as stable as you, you know? So I think you're realizing that you were caught up in an illusion on that and now you're realizing that you're the stable one and the only, you know, you only want to seek guidance from your your higher self, your ancestors, your guides, or people that are line, aligned and brought to you spiritually. You're starting to lean way more towards that way. I also seem to hear with like whenever I've seen that too, like someone might be spying on you because they have interest in um, you as their person. I got that too as I was going to get more cards. Okay. What else, Spirit? Thank you. Justice. Okay. So you're really starting to see things more evenly, like um, more focused on giving yourself justice than giving other people justice, which is just like another form of you like realizing things for what they are and not, um, not going off of what other people want you to do. You're starting to want to make decisions that are going to give you justice, that are going to um, work out in your favor. The emperor... Okay, so you or this person, whoever I'm picking up on, is wanting to be in this energy. And right, that's all four kings combined. This would, it's great father, business owner, um, definitely would be a great, like, you know, like counterpart. This is, this is who you want to come in union with is an empress or an emperor. You may be being defensive right now, or you may have people coming after you, but this is spirit reminding you that you have the high ground, okay? That you have everything you need, but you know, like even if you think you don't, you have it. Hold on. Everything, you already know the truth. You know the truth. And you know not like, not to give in to what other people want to say is the truth. I hope that made sense. I think this is also showing you being quieter right now and letting a bunch of people talk around you so that you can really, you know what I mean? Like the saying, give them enough rope to hang themselves. Sometimes you just need to be quiet and set back and let people talk. And they'll tell you everything that you need to know. People that lie, their story is never the same. People that um, are manipulative and stuff, they will tie themselves up in what they're saying. Um, it won't add up uh, they'll, they'll tell on themselves. So I really feel like you're being in this energy where you're starting to really watch the people around you and you're saying less. Okay. So, and some people may have really hurt you here, but you're learning skills. Okay. This is the wounded warrior. So you have been completely hurt 
by a lot of people around you that's like not wanting to take responsibility. But this is also you learning those skills. Like you have now learned skills that you're trying to put in place where you're not telling everybody your game plan, where you're not giving people the ammunition to tear down your plans before you even get them started. So you're starting to realize that some of the shit you go through is to grow you is to help you expand. Okay, let me show you. I'm gonna use some of the Divine Goddess Oracle deck. My eyes are really dry. I wonder if that means something. Confession, release a secret, pursuing virtue through honesty. So, like I said, I feel like you or somebody is gonna be coming to you. You really either gonna be telling somebody the truth or somebody is gonna be coming to you telling um, like a confession, like a secret that they had, something like that and I definitely feel that way with the King of Swords here with the Ace of Swords. I think that's just confirmation. What do you want? What do you want the Earth signs to know, Spirit? What do the Earth signs need to know? Communicate, receive, and express the truth. I mean, the other card was saying about the truth also, and it was just eleven eleven um in the timestamps. Okay, so like it's just confirmation that. The truth needs to be told in these situations or that you have, you, you know, the truth or both, you know, you know, the truth. Um, you need to tell the truth. Somebody needs to tell the truth to you. Something along those lines, fear, expecting the worst, afraid of failure and wasting time on negative thoughts. Spirit is just telling you right here with this to start getting used to reprogramming your mind. Let the thoughts come in naturally. And when you have a fear based thought, Correct it. Just correct it. Just stop. Just stop yourself and then replace it with something, you know, really positive. That's how you retrain your brain. What else, Spirit? What would you like the earth signs to know? Sacrifice. Giving up something now for future reward. Again, I feel like this is what you or somebody in your energy is contemplating doing. I did get the word contemplating. So this is not actually being done yet. This is this is in the thought process of being done. Spread your wings. Confidence that leads to freedom of growth. So like this is all like going together. All right. Someone is really all in the whole like thought process of like making sacrifices for the betterment of their life, which ultimately aren't sacrifices are things that needed to be let go of in order for you to grow. It's just like, you know, when you have a rose bush and you have to go out there and get rid of, you know, the dead, um, the dead buds, the, the leaves, all that stuff. So it can, so it can grow because what happens in plants when you don't do that, there's still water and nutrition and stuff going there that could be going to the rest of the plant. So you see how that slows it down. If you have people, places, or things that are feeding off of you that you are taking care of that are not reciprocating back the same energy, you are not going to grow um, the way you were intended to. Not as fast. You're going to feel stagnant. Your growth is going to be much slower. Strength, determination, preservation, and self-discovery. So this is, and look, soulmates right there. The divine will provide you with the love when you are ready. So like spirit is waiting for you or the person's energy that I'm picking up on right now um, to, to do these things, to get these things in order so that they can give them that. You cannot have um, a divine relationship or a soulmate come into your life if you're not ready, because you're not going to treat them appropriately. And this is, I really like that strength was there. Hold on, do I have strength? Yeah, because like it's in reverse here. Okay. So this person's feeling at the beginning of this reading, this person's feeling like they don't have the strength to do this, but they're starting, you know, like they are going to gain that strength or spirit is trying to give them a formula so that they can spread their wings so that they can have the strength to spread their wings. Okay. What else, spirit? For the earth signs. Awakening. Definitely. Like all these cards to me feel like, you know, you or your person is going through an awakening, a realization shift or discovery. Leap of faith. Taking a risk. Stepping into the beauty of the unknown. I'm sorry. I know I didn't show you guys the awakening. 
up confession release a secret again <laughs> this one this must have been the bottom of the deck and then it came out um releasing a secret releasing a secret pursuing virtue through honesty okay the word honesty and honest i mean like tr the word truth or telling the truth has came up two or three times the word honesty has came up um Ace of Swords, which is like truth, clarity, or telling the truth. King of Swords is about speaking the truth. So that's everything here. Justice. Like somebody deserves an apology. Somebody deserves justice in this situation. And that's going to come from a confession or the truth. Okay. This is beautiful. Okay. Well, Earth Signs, I hope this helps you. Please let me know. I will see you guys later.